watching the 2015 SCAC Women's Soccer Media Days. We are joined now by Centenary Women's Head Coach David Orr and Senior Madison Alexander. Guys, thanks for being with me today. Yeah, thank you. Mm-hmm. So, uh, Coach, what has preseason been like for you so far? It's been good. Uh, we've been uh, the weather's cooperated, <laughs> which has been nice. Um, it's been a little bit cooler here, but uh, it's been good. The players came in. Uh, they're having lots of fun. I'm having lots of fun, uh, working hard, and uh, just kind of getting ready. Looking forward to this to the beginning of the season. How have the uh, how have the freshmen looked so far? Do you have any uh, any good depth out of the freshman class? Do you think? Oh, absolutely. I think our freshmen came in ready to go. A um, lot of lot of athleticism uh, in this freshman class. Definitely going to help add depth to the team. Uh, I think they're going to be pretty heavy contributors as well. So excited about them. You have a lot of uh, a lot of experienced players on this team, including Madison. How do you see them contributing in 2015, and and uh, how do you think they're going to play into the system? Well, experience is invaluable. Um, their leadership, mentorship, uh, role modeling, so important. Um, helps just about in every way, uh, having this large core of seniors. I mean, they've been there. They've done that. Um, they've got great positive attitudes. They're really working hard to uh, create a very positive team culture. Um, uh, you know, they're trying to help assist in the stages of the centenary leadership model with the uh, centenary connect, commit, lead, grow. Uh, philosophy uh, with the younger players uh, in their in the early stages so far, so it's been great. Madison, can you give us an idea of, of what it's like to play on this team for you? What's what's one of your favorite things about this team? I enjoy playing on this team because everyone is so competitive, and yet it's its own family. A lot of us are miles and miles away from our parents or where we come from, and you come here, and it's like you never left. I mean. Even the coaches and the training staff and the girls were, were a unit and on, off the field, and everywhere we go. How do you feel like you've changed as a player during the off season? What's what's a personal goal that you have for 2015? I mainly focused on mentally preparing for my new position. Uh, outside mid was a bit of a stretch for me last year, but I'm coping nicely, I like to think. And uh, a goal this year is to be in the tournament and be competitive and get past a couple rounds. Coach, was there was there one thing or maybe several things that you saw from from 2014 that you think uh, you and your team have focused on improving so far in the preseason? Oh yeah, definitely. Probably the first and foremost thing was last year's preseason, which was my first with the team. Uh, we, we just had a lot of injuries early in preseason, and we've taken a lot of uh, steps this preseason to combat that, stay healthy, and, and thus far it's worked out really well. Uh, the other part is uh, that's been really good this preseason is being last year the first preseason with the team. It's kind of a change of philosophy, a change of culture, and this has allowed us to now we now know each other a lot better. Um, our communications better, uh, reading each other's better, and and so far it's it's been it's been a lot more fun. I mean we've all kind of feel comfortable with each other, um, and it's it's making practice. These girls come out to practice and. Uh, they're excited to be there, which uh, makes the environment just great. Madison, looking ahead at your schedule, is there is there one game or maybe a couple of games that you're looking forward to more than others? Uh, my The game I'm really looking forward to is our October 2nd game versus University of Dallas. We always usually travel on my birthday weekend on the 4th, and we're actually off this year, which is a first for my time at Centenary, but I always like to play that weekend Everyone on their birthday seems to have a little extra pep. So it'll be a good game for sure. So, Coach, last question for you. For for someone who's just getting acclimated to this team, for someone who's never watched this team play, what is one thing that you would want them to take away? So so they say, you know, when I watch that team, they are a team that does what? Uh, they're going to see that this team has a lot of fun. I think that it's infectious. I think that uh, – Fans are going to really enjoy those that are coming out and seeing us for the first time. And even those that have seen us for a while, uh, they're going to see this renewed sense of enjoyment out on the field. The players are having a good time in practice. You can see it from warm-up to the very end. Uh, I think the first game and, and each game throughout, because they all live to play the game. and Nobody really enjoys the practice as much as the games. Uh, 
I think they're going to see that fun. They enjoy what they do. And I think people are going to be able to see that very easily. Centenary women's soccer head coach David Orr and senior Madison Alexander. Guys, thanks for your time today, and good luck this season. Yeah, God bless. Thank thanks. You.